Hey. We are live, 2022 Hershey RV Show. I am here. I know some, everybody, we had a lot of people join yesterday. Yes. MJ. I, I said I was missing my other half. Yeah, MJ was a trooper. She drove out here early. I had to work. And uh, she did all this. She went live on her own. Yeah. Oh, wow. You make it sound like I'm an idiot or something. <laughs> I can't handle it. No, but you, you couldn't respond to the chat. Right. You know, yeah, it's that usually was, like a team effort. That was a little difficult. So. so let's wait a couple minutes so we get some people in here. Uh, for anybody that has not subscribed and hit the notification bell, if this is the first time with us, you're going to want to do that. We are, again, at the 2022 Hershey RV Show. And we're going to be going live a lot now. Just uh, some ground rules here. Uh, we're going to try to answer as many chats as we can. It's not possible. Another ground rule. We're not taking requests. Yeah, we can't, we can't guys, do yeah, that. Guys, we get a lot of people requesting, can you we get this? Quite can, a few you, emails. can you take a picture of the price of it? Like, we just don't have time to do we that, can't unfortunately. Do that. It's just because too many. we get so many people asking that. Plus, we have to do our videos. So that's not possible. But, um, that's why we try to do these lives and bring you here as much as we possibly can and give you the experience if you're not able to come. We're also going to be doing premieres every night. Let me fix this a little bit. Premieres every night. Uh, hopefully we can get something uploaded tonight. We already have one ready to go. We're not going to tell you what it is. If it, it gets uploaded, cool. we'll put it up tonight. If not, it'll be up tomorrow. Yeah, speed's a little slow. Uh, there's some cool things we're seeing here. We were gonna go, we're gonna start in the Airstream section. Right. So why don't we go, we're actually right so, here. Yeah, Airstream was, were they here? They weren't here last year, right? They were in Tampa. Yeah, yes. so they weren't here last year. I think that's Les Junkmore Journey over there. Welcome uh, everybody. So oh, let's, yeah. yeah. Let's go over to the Airstream. Let's start over here on the left here oh, with the interstate maybe. where there's less of a crowd. Uh, let's move this a little bit. So right. we're not gonna get to super duper description. We're just gonna kind of go in walk through Give them little looks there's a lot of cool stuff here this year show have you the new um the new flying cloud which i'm excited to see so this is your 2023 interstate 24x as you remember you don't have a mic on so you gotta speak loud yeah. this is four-wheel drive so here you go your typical sideways let's turn everything on walk. if we can There we go. go. Give me some power. Nice. I actually, I do like this better than the one we stayed in. This is really nice. Oh, it is a little, it's different, but here's your bathroom. Well, although I think this is, can you just hold this? Just so you can give, oh, so, uh, so oh, sorry. people wait, can wait. see. What am I doing? Yeah, oh my God. Go. I got, I'm holding 16 different things here. Okay. Just so you can kind of get a feel for it. Uh, well, I guess it's okay. I mean. You have to be under six foot for sure. Yeah, a little tight. But it's a van, so. I want to say hi to everybody that's coming in. We got a pub, Papa Drew, or hey, Papa Drew. Blue Ox on the run. Hi, guys. Um, one of our insiders, Michelle, is here saying hi from the Dominican Republic. Nice. That's dedication. I'm You're jealous. watching us from the DR. Thanks, Michelle. Appreciate that. Are there any renegades? A couple people asked that, and I just said to you this morning, I don't think they're here. You have to look at the map. I haven't seen them anywhere, so not sure about that. But. And as far as the prices, no prices are posted right now. Right now, So, again, I know a lot of people ask for the price uh, until they're posted when the show starts. We don't know what the prices are other than MSRP. So there's the 24GL. Here are some of the specs on it. And just a quick walkthrough on it. This is cute. I like this. Uh, the lights teeth. on. Hey, Tom and Missy. Hi, guys. Hey, I everyone. Know, I know you're going to be here tomorrow. Um, yeah, this is pretty cool. I like it. It's cozy. Yeah. I could, I could do a a february trip in this yeah because you know on that one they don't uh they don't have the dedicated bed so right you have a little bit more space we'll do one more van and then we'll kind of go over to their trailers yeah that's i do want to see the new the new flying cloud the flying cloud actually let's do the atlas i like the atlas
So we were in a nine foot, or was it a 17? Oh, beautiful. I'm not letting them in, sorry. Let's just do the outside with MJ gets everything on the inside. So we're big fans of the Atlas. Here are some of the specs on the Atlas. All right. It's such a difference that one slide makes. Oh my God, man, this is so, this is so nice. Look, you got a little mirror there. Yep. Look at how spacious this is. You got your Murphy bed, which is amazing. Right? And you have a real bathroom. And you have a, uh, a TV. On a we could rock an, an Atlas on a Class B. It'd have to have a slide at minimum. Ugh. It's just too small, no, but and then after that weekend, that was too tight. Freezer and uh, you got your convection microwave there. Nice you smell thing. the cedar? Yes. It's very strong. And I think this is your garbage. Yeah, I love that. They do the little garbage can. You want to talk a little bit about the weather this weekend? The weather today. Beautiful, but let's show the bathroom first because it's. like airplane style then you got a large here we'll switch except it on the airplane there's urine all over the floor true <laughs> and you really can't move but this is nice look at this well that cedar hits you hard all right mm -hmm. yes yeah, so the weather is absolutely beautiful today it is can you just pull for the share yeah so this is definitely doable it's a nice finish too you look like you're in one of those uh, those money things where the air starts blowing all the money out. <laughs> um, yeah, so the weather is, it's about 70 something, 75, maybe sunny. The whole week is gonna be beautiful. We're on a mission of slaughtering as many lantern bugs as we can. The spotted lanterns, yeah, they're very- I got a couple under my belt already. All right, let's go to the trailers. Yeah, let's go. You want to go into base camp if anybody's interested? Base camp 20X. Hey guys, I live 25 minutes away from here. Some of the specs on there. You know, this looks just like an impact. You think so? It's very similar. I mean, not totally. This actually feels a lot bigger than it is. Uh huh. Huh. Look at this. That's pretty cool. The, uh, the table. I don't think we've been in one of these. No. And here's your... Hold on, let me get back here. Again, this is all non-slide. Yeah, this is your wet bath. I do love to clean. Oh, check these out. Right, that's kind of cool. Three storage compartments there. I love the raw stainless finish. Yeah. yeah. And I like kind of the way it slopes down. All the, all the cabinets are the same kind of this muted it's nice and you got what is it two burners nice and the round the round bowl cool you your top up there your power power tower let's go back out let's go a little bigger no like somebody said the stain, no but they have you like yellow blood they're really annoying they come flying at you and they just, they kind of, like, you feel them. It's like they come for you. It's the wings. The wings get you. They're more annoying than, in, yeah, painful. Look who's here. How you doing, How you doing guys? Say hi. We're live. Yeah. What's up, guys? Well, first we're in the airstream. <laughs> so, Nate right. from Let's Jug More Journey, everybody. What's going on, guys? Going? You getting some film? We are. Yeah, yeah, they, they have some really cool new looking things this what's, year. What's the coolest thing you've seen? Well, I want to look at the flying cloud, but the, uh, what's the one that we're looking at? Well, the Atlas, that's not new, but it's definitely upgraded. And then what was the one? Let's see you guys. This one. This one. Okay, okay. Yeah. It looks big. It is. It's big inside. Okay. It's like an eight of base game. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to walk around while you guys talk. 
I don't get all up in their private conversation. So I'll take you around. Uh, cool thing, industry day is that it's not too crowded and um, you see everybody. All the YouTube channels are here for the most part. It's a pretty awesome thing. So let's move down. Let's check out that new flying cloud. Let's see, have it smack dead in the middle. All right, here it is. So you guys are gonna to want to check out. We just did a, uh, a nice Integra. Uh, that was a 40 foot, really spacious. So here's the Flying Cloud, the 25 FBQ. There are all the specs. 119, 325 is the MSRP. Let's start around the front here. And of course, you know, all stainless, riveted. You have the huge front windshield glass there. I don't know why they're not doing, well, I don't know. Is this, oh, it is tankless. I was gonna say, I don't know why they're not doing tankless, but they are. And double axle, which is what you want. Goodyear tires. Look around the back here. I do like the, uh, the trunk style, garage style door. Gives you wide access to the back. Let's go inside. See what it looks like inside. Guys, put in the comments, what do you think about this? Always with that infinity weave, I do like that. I do like the gray color. Again, I like the raw finish. Let's just give it a quick pan. I like what they did in the bedroom there. So it looks like they have a desk here. Really nice. Now, I don't know, is this, is this handicap accessible? I'm not quite sure. That Actually, I think this is handicap accessible, which will make sense for the rear here, but that's just my thought. That's not fact. Nice European style cabinets, everything clean, hidden hinges. Uh, let's go to the kitchen here. Now, I don't believe this is a solid surface. This feels like some kind of laminate. Decent sized fridge. ACs are really going hard here. Is this a handicap accessible? No. Well, I don't know because. I can find you. This is nice. Oh, they got the bunk up there too. Yeah, I was. I don't think this is handicap. This is just a desk. Yeah. This. Oh, you see this? Well, I can't. You, got you split, locked me in. The split bath there. That's a shower. All right, so this is definitely not handicap accessible because they won't be able to get a ramp in there. Nice big closet. So somebody said overpriced. Yeah, Airstreams are quite expensive. Um, you know, you're paying for the name. It is all stainless. And they do have high resale value. This is pretty awesome here, this desk area. Yeah. Those air conditioners are keeping it quite cool, for sure. And that's with the door open, too. Yeah. Somebody missed yeah. the uh, the request. Yeah, Michelle, we can't force. We can't take requests. Sorry, because we have so many people requesting things. So we just kind of show you what we're planning on showing you. So yeah, they can help us out. It's the garbage can. This is very cool. This workspace. And this looks like it's electronic, right? Yeah. So we'll go down flush. Actually, that's a really cool idea because. It gives you like that extra counter space yeah, if you look. Yeah. So obviously that will go all the way down. A lot of light coming in here too. We've got a ton of windows. And then this is what I love too. I mean, just open up, you know? See yeah. that on the edge of the mountain? <laughs> like they do in the pictures. Yeah. All right, let's go to the big one. The, uh, I think they had an international classic on the other side. We'll start getting larger here. Globe trotter. It's a 30 footer. It's quickly on the outside. 30 feet, 11 inches in length. This is the Globe trotter. Price 145, 475 on the MSRP. 8800 gross vehicle weight rating. 
This one you like? See, you know what's so funny? I know. Is that MJ was so anti Airstream when we first started RVing. Anti, can you, anti can you kill that radio? Yeah. <laughs> we don't want to get a, uh, a strike for copyright stuff. Nothing? MJ's trying to find the radio. I'll walk around. I'm just going to walk around the outside. Nothing? Here, you want to hold this? I'll, I'll try to find it. It's got to be like somewhere hidden. All right. All right. Yeah, we can't, guys, we can't go in there with music playing because then we'll get demonetized. So we got to turn the radio off. Turn the radio off before we go in. Yeah, but this is a beautiful looking, uh, looking RV. Nothing? Oh, it's covered? All right. How slick. Now we can come. Right here. Oh, see, I opened that. I didn't see it. All right. Okay. So... They just make all their cabinets and everything in just like these sleek looking, and they're all different too. Yeah. You know what I mean? And you probably like this because you have the contrasting wood with the I do like that. light furniture. Look at this. Look at, look at this. Yeah, it's a tremendous amount of space yeah, again. I mean, it's 30 feet, so, you know, you're getting, wow, that's pretty deep. Okay, you got it. Nice, that's not. Nice. What do I feel like they're putting more windows too, like bigger windows? Yeah. Those come out, I think. Yeah, but you can't move it. Is there storage under there? Anywhere else, yes. Oh, check that out. And all the way across, too. All right, so, okay. You've got pantry. Oh, the air is nice Feels and cold. Good. That's a pretty large bathroom. Oops. Uh oh, you broke it. No, that's just that's not your fault because no, it's not the my set, fault. The it's set's not, not in there. Okay. Nice little wow. Nice. Let me but, just get in here. You know, you have the separate separate. Please beds. keep off the bedding. You gotta put a sign. Of course, well people are sitting on it. Telescope out so both can see it, and then you got more cabinets behind you. So there's double air conditioners in here, keeping it nice and cold. Let me just give you one more shot of the bedroom. All right, and then scoot out to walking. Check this out. Front. Look at this. So I said they have they have that right, mm -hmm. the Airstream garbage can. But look, look here. Another one that could nice. be like recycling or something, yeah. you know. All right, you want to do a couple more? Yeah, and then we'll, we'll call it. But again, guys, if you're not subscribed or if you don't have the notification bell, you want to do that because we're going to be going live when we see something we like. We're just going to go live. So if you have that notification bell on, you will get notified when we're live, and we don't have a set time that we're going to do it just when we have the opportunity all right this is the international 23 fbt 23 feet 9 inches all right double axle let's go inside this is 109475 is the msrp on this so first thing you come in gross vehicle weight rating 6,000 pounds 
you got the, the to-do list to hang your whatevers, hang your hat. Nice bathroom. There's no air in this one that's on. And the toilet is in an interesting position. And then you have, again, it's not a wet bath, so that's a nice thing. Yeah, that toilet, that step it's up on is, could be troublesome for some people, I think. Not that you're stepping up on it, but just the way you're seated. You're kind of like squatting as you're yeah. crapping. So this is kind of like the, um, I'm sorry, <laughs> the other one, the pantry there, the thing above. Is it your fan up above? Very cool. Well, I like the, just like the color schemes too. Airstream does a really nice job. Ah, some hidden Cabinets storage. within a cab. Ah, look at that. Silverware tray. Awesome. Nice. Three burners, convection oven. Now, this is a little tight in here. Well, it's 23 feet. Yeah, you have less feet, but... Now, we did a one on the uh, Pottery Barn Edition. If yeah. you go to our playlist of uh, RV tours, we did a full detail. You can just search endless RVing Airstream, Airstream. Out of your Pottery Barn. I like the contrast of colors. So you have like the white and gray on the walls and the counters. Then you got the blue furniture and then you have the flooring I like. It's cool. Their bedrooms are very cozy. I don't like the split bed. Somebody else said they don't like the split bed because, you, you know, if you're married, yeah. it's like... Well, I think you can get them in different... Yeah, I know, but these... Nice closet. Although there's some days married couples might want to sleep apart for the night if they're fighting. <laughs> wow. Look at this. Yeah, really nice. Yeah, nice flooring, somebody said. Yeah, it really is. Nice contrast of colors. Very nice. Let's go to the big boy over here. The classic. Even small, you got 22 foot Bambi single axle. I love the names too. Bambi. Bambi, Flying Cloud. So you got a 30 RBQ. I think that's going to be rear bed queen, maybe? 31 feet, 5 inches, 10,000 pound gross vehicle weight ratings is 181.7. This is going to be a large one. Double axle on this. This is very similar to that pottery barn, like the setup. Ah, music. Oh, yeah. Play the music. I didn't realize. Yeah. Sorry. Here. You know all that? I'm going to go find it. It's probably in the same. We've got to turn the music off, guys. Now they hit it somewhere else. I'll just show you some more of the show here while Izzy's looking. There's Thor over there. Thor is over there. They've got the new Outlaw with the, the neon green right there, which is kind of cool. You got it? All right. All right, here we go. Nice booth seating. Nothing, huh? Uh, I think that opens, does but it? yeah, it looks like it does. I was gonna say, why well, don't... Uh, yeah. I was gonna say, how do you have that with no storage? So yeah, so you'll have the full length. MJ broke it. I did not break it. It's not. Oh my Here, God. hold this. Give him the tour of the bedroom. <laughs> no, because I think everybody's going to want to see you fix it now. See? It's off the track. I know. Uh, All right, let me show. Hey. You broke it. I didn't break squat. Okay, guys, let's go into the bedroom. And then we'll show you the rest coming back. So here's your bedroom. This is not a good look for uh, no. the Airstream. But so you'll see the lights flickering, guys. It's just with the camera here. You got your TV over here. And then you're going to have... And break it, you bought it. <laughs> nice. It's fixed. Nice bedroom. Thank you, hon. All right. Here's your bedroom. Uh, bathroom, sorry. <laughs> It's a nice spacious bathroom. Large full full length mirror, which a lot of RVs don't have. And then here is your big, you always get that big closet, you know? Even in the smaller models, they're always giving you some good storage space. Are All you right. in the shower? Not yet, no. That's... On your left there. 
Okay. You ready? Actually, no, I'm sorry. Oh, the shower. I'm thinking bed, uh, bathroom. Here's a shower stall. One piece. Oh, no, it's not a one piece. Nice inside. Nice uh, skylight here, which can close, and your privacy curtain here. Yes, somebody nice. said cedar. The closet is cedar lined. Yeah, I, I do like the diamond stitching in here mm -hmm. on the seat. It's a nice classy look. And you got a lot of um, counter space. You know what you don't get? Here's your extra. What you don't get in Airstream is like the fancy backsplashes and all of that kind it's of stuff. Raw. But it's just raw. It's just sleek and simple and it, it looks really good don't forget the case yeah <laughs> is this show about the same or bigger than last year now there's more stuff yeah, here there's definitely more rvs than last year for sure yeah because airstream was even here last year right uh, let's was, uh... turn this around so uh any other ones you want to look at i think that's well, you want to you want to just see if the Thor Outlaws open. You want to stick to Airstream. These are, these are very. Well, just check the Thor. These are very interesting. I was just um, showing that when you were in trying to figure out the radio paint scheme. <laughs> like well, this little neon green. Uh, maybe it's reflective if like lights hit it. It blinds you. That is a huge coach, though, for a gasser. You see how the, the roof how it kind of yeah, goes up. It's a thirty-eight kb Kilo Bravo thirty-eight kb. And it's open. You want to do a little scouting in there while I do the outside? Full body paint, of course. Here's the Outlaw. Now, the Outlaws are toy haulers. you got double slide on the driver's side. Looks like you have the tankless water heater. Very popular coach. Not something that would be our style. We don't really... Let's just say we don't like the toy hauler. It's not something we would probably utilize that much, but... If you have kids, you want that area, that porch area in the back, you want to take toys with you, uh, it's definitely something that interests a lot of people. And you got a second entrance on the passenger side, and then that whole gate is going to come down, which we're not going to do, but you can get your toys in there as well as set up as a patio. This is a gas coach V8 Godzilla motor. Well, this one has the MSRP 305760. Guys, the prices on motorhomes have just are just insane. The show price is 219 995 which when we bought our motorhome, the MSRP was actually less than what the show price is right now, but everything is negotiable. Somebody said his airstream ever discount. Everybody discounts. You have to work with you know, work with, but yeah, you're not gonna pay full price. I was just commenting that when we bought our motorhome not that long ago, yeah. this was actually more than the MSRP. It's 305 right, right, MSRP. Right. Oof, it's crazy. So, first. I mean, this is, you know, it's a Thor. <laughs> it's, uh, you know, it's spacious and it definitely serves me a need if you're, if you're looking for it that. It smells funny in here. Yeah. Right? So, you know, you have, for tall people, this is really good yeah. because you're getting that, that high ceiling, that angled ceiling. Now, that's a bunk so that drops up there. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay. What I, I got to tell you, what I do like that I'm seeing is how that goes down into the garage. Mm -hmm. That That's kind of cool. Right. So, you got your fridge here. Here's your bathroom, which for a tall person is ideal. Yeah, if you want to just get kind yeah, of... Yeah, I mean, you can... Now, you're stepping up, but again, it's that, that uh, sweeping right, roof. Right, goes up, so you have... If you're tall, you know, you may be looking over this, but plenty of <laughs> space to shower. They have the shower miser, which is always nice. Help save some of that uh, gray water. All touch screen, firefly system. I do like the little kitchen with the yeah, combo counter induction counter and propane. Yeah. That's nice. You get the best of both worlds. A little, little backsplash action there. And I like the spice rack. Is that what you just said or no? That's No, no. no. I was talking about the induction. Yeah, the spice rack is nice. There's, yeah. You could put anything back there. Privacy door here. They use the hideaway bed, so that's good. Definitely the same space. 
because this is obviously with the garage you're you know you're tight on space here there's your tv up there you got a lot of um storage this is really tall inside so i don't know yes. if you can get a feeling just stand right there so look how high that ceiling is yeah i'm five nine so it is but you see it outside you know and then yeah then you have your garage this is cool this is like have, a separate apartment. You know, sleeping area, TV, yeah. There's, there's no bathroom, but it's okay. Um, the lights are on in here. They Let's... should. There we go. Oops. There we go. Let's just give you a little bit. Oh, look at this. You missed this, hon. Is that another bunk? Yes. What is that? Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Wow, this slopes down. You gotta be careful. <laughs> yeah. And then you have so, kind of like a wall. Your, yeah, and the fan up there, so you'll have like you can sleep a lot of people in here. So normally, what? Ladder, ladder yeah, normally on toy haulers you have It'll something drop that drops down. down. Right. This just chooses to keep a permanent uh, the thing is, loft, though, really. With the tall thing here, you're gonna feel it. So yeah. You have to kind of until you pass the bed, but. But yeah, you can definitely fit a lot of stuff back here. Yeah. And I like this. It's kind of like that patio glass. So you can lock the kids yes. out. You know, I would like it better if it were... There's oh. a screen. No, but like completely, you know what I'm saying, dark. Oh, tinted out. Yeah, because you have a bedroom. Say you have kids and you have the master bedroom here. It's, yeah. you know. I got a guy for that. I got a guy. Two dollars. We could get it tinted out. <laughs> <laughs> I got a guy. Okay, so you got little chargers here, which is good. I don't see any 110, 110 outlets. Maybe once it might be, comes yeah. out, you know. Or maybe out. underneath. Yeah. Alrighty. A lot of people MJ's going to the tilt. Not we're actually not using mics because we're on our phone. So if I'm not in front of the phone, you're not going to hear me. That's why. Yeah. Sorry about that. So we hope you guys enjoyed that. Again. Um, Make sure to subscribe, make sure to hit the notification bell so when we do go live, which will be often, <laughs> uh, you are going to know the latest and greatest from the show, right? Yeah. So thank you guys for joining us. Check us out on our premiere, hopefully coming out tonight. If not, tomorrow we have something coming out. Thanks, guys. Bye.